TMJ4 is celebrating Black History Month. Some people have a knack for bringing out the best in you, and the woman you are about to meet does that every day. Yes, she mentors people across Milwaukee, inspiring them to reach for the stars. Mary Jo Ola brings you her story tonight. People call, text me all day. They start in the morning. What should I do? <laughs> Where should I go? Can we meet? Uh, and, and that's fine because we have to lift as we climb. Melanie Gray starts her day before many of us are even awake, mentoring several people in their professional and personal lives. That's in addition to her day job as program manager for trauma-informed care at Aurora Sinai in downtown Milwaukee. Why do you make it work? Because people are important. I didn't get to a journey, go through a journey of 20 years, 25 years in nursing without someone investing in me. Melanie grew up in Milwaukee's 53206 zip code. Her father worked as a welder and her mother was a licensed practical nurse or LPN. Melanie's journey led her to a career in nursing, then a master's degree, then a doctorate. Gloria Gilmer, a math pioneer from Milwaukee who accomplished many firsts as an African-American woman, was Melanie's mentor along the way. Gilmer taught her to pay it forward. She would say all the time, Melanie, we must lift as we climb. We must lift as we climb. And when she would do her checks with me, she'd say, now what are you doing? Who are you helping? Here at Aurora Sinai, Melanie's passion for mentorship has helped colleagues see their potential and form lasting friendships. <laughs> it's been nice. Like sometimes I call her Mama, Mama Melanie. Karina Brown met Melanie nearly 10 years ago through the Milwaukee chapter Black Nurses Association. Melanie loves on you hard. You know, it's, it's a good love. She, she prays for you, always, um, always making sure that you're okay. Since then, Karina's career went from bedside nurse to a leadership role where she aims to help others. For Melanie, lifting others up is a way of life. Each one of us must see ourselves as being able to make a difference. Mary Jo Ola, TMJ4 News.